Welcome to our tutorial on how to use the Red X Dex app to design your perfect deck. Whether you are a professional or a DIY enthusiast, this app simplifies the deck design process, making it accessible to everyone. As we open the app, you'll notice two options. Selecting from predefined deck shapes or drawing a deck from scratch. For today, we'll focus on creating a simple straight deck from the predefined shapes. Upon selecting the straight deck option, the app generates a default straight deck for us. Notice the Manage Layers button in the bottom right corner. This handy feature allows us to hide or show components like deck boards, joists, floor beams, and more. To adjust the deck's dimensions, tap the Edit Measurements button, also located in the bottom right. Within this panel, you can modify properties such as deck width, length, rise, joist spacing, and total deck load, which defaults to 50 pounds per square feet. The beauty of Red X Dex lies in its ability to automatically calculate the deck's structure based on five key parameters, joist spacing, total deck load, joist material size, joist material grade, and joist material species. This determines the maximum joist span and the maximum space between beams. All right, let's dive deeper. I'll hide the deck boards to reveal the joists. Now watch as I adjust the deck width and length. Notice how the beams are automatically placed in the optimal positions based on the properties we've selected. To demonstrate the dynamic placement of beams, let's change the joist material size. Observe how the beam positions adjust accordingly. The colors on the deck joists, green for optimal, yellow for normal, and red for maximum load, indicate their structural capacity. If you prefer not to see these indications, you can toggle off joist structural errors in the Layers menu. For a practical demonstration, I'll adjust the dropped beam's position, tap the beam once to highlight it, and then just drag to move it and watch the colors change from green to yellow and to red. Should we extend too far, a red X appears, indicating a structural error. But no worries, let's reset our beam's positions Tap on the deck to highlight it and press the orange Auto Generate Beams button. Watch as the app automatically optimizes beam placement for us. In the next video, we will look into the cut list and explore navigating the 3D model.